a very good morning to all. So in the last class, we started with the new chapter that is insects. And we learned about, what did we learn? We learned about the body parts of an insect. And it is divided into three main parts. So which are the three main parts? The three main parts are the head, the thorax and the abdomen. So today we are going to learn about the eating habits of insects. So all living things eat, all living things need air, water and food to live. And these insects also need food to live. And what do they eat? And how do they eat? So today let's learn about the eating habits of different insects. So do all insects eat the same food? No. So different insects eat different types of food. So let's start with the first one. There are insects like butterflies, moth, bees. So do you know what these birds feed on? They feed on nectar and they have a thin tube mouth part. They have a thin tube like mouth part which helps them to suck the nectar from the flower. So what is this nectar? The nectar is the sweet liquid which is present on the flower. And these butterflies, moth and bees depend on nectar for their food. And what about insects like grasshoppers? So they feed on leaves of the plant. Coming to the next one, you all have seen mosquitoes, right? So what do these mosquitoes feed on? So there are mosquitoes which feed on nectar. And what about their mouth part? They have a sharp pointed mouth part which helps them to suck the blood of animals and human beings. So even there are mosquitoes which suck the blood. So we all are familiar, right? So we all are familiar with the mosquitoes which suck the blood of animals as well as human beings. So even there are mosquitoes which feed on nectar and they have a sharp tube-like mouth part that helps them to suck their food. Then coming to the next one, there are insects which feed on other insects. You know which are that insects? Dragonflies. Have you heard about dragonflies? These dragonflies feed on mosquitoes. And what about this ladybird beetle? Have you heard about this insect? This insect feed on other insects which damage the plants. So this insect feed on other insects that damage the plants. So this beetle, this ladybird beetle or the ladybug is called as the farmer's friend. Why? Because this insect feed on the insect that damage the plants. So that is why they are called as the farmer's friend. And the next type of insect that is the dung beetle. And do you know what, uh, what do they feed on? Which is very interesting. They feed on animal dung. These insects feed on animal dung and even they keep the surroundings clean. And even these dung beetles are called rollers. You know why they are called as rollers? Because they roll the animal dung. They roll the animal dung and then they feed on it. So that they are called as rollers. So what do they feed? They feed on animal dung. Coming to the next one, that is the termites. So have you heard about this, termites? So do you know what do they feed on? They feed on the root of the plant. So you all know what happens if the root of a plant is damaged. So what happens if the root of a plant is damaged? If the root of a plant is damaged, the plant dies. So this termites feed on the root of the plant. And even they feed on the wood of the tree and kills the tree. So that is about termites. And what about ant? So ant feed on everything that is around them. And they usually feed sweet food which is dropped on the floor. If you open any of this sweet food in your table and after sometimes you can see a group of ants around them. They usually feed on sweet food but they feed on everything which is around them. And there are even other insects like the flies, cockroach. They feed on all kinds of things and dirt. And they spread diseases. They carry germs and spread diseases. Even these mosquitoes, they carry germs and spread diseases. 
So this is about the eating habits of different insects. Some insects feed on nectar, that is the sweet liquid which is present on the flower. And there are insects which feed on the blood of the animals and human beings. There are insects which feed on other insects. In the last class we learned how do these insects breathe. So these insects have a tiny holes which is present in their body that is called the spiracles and the air enters through these fine tubes and reaches all parts of the body of the insect. So this is how they breathe and how do they breathe? They breathe through the tiny holes which is present in the body that is called the spiracles. And the next one, all insects lay eggs. So do insects lay eggs? Yes, they lay eggs. The young insects hatch from the eggs. Different insects lay eggs on plants, some in water, etc. So let's see some insects and where do they lay eggs. So there are insects like the butterfly, moth, they lay eggs on the plant. So you can see the picture here. On the plants, they lay eggs and they lay eggs and the young ones hatch from the egg. And what about these mosquitoes? So where do these mosquitoes lay eggs? They lay eggs in water. And the next one, honeybee. Where do these honeybees lay eggs? They lay eggs in the hive. So insects, all insects lay eggs and the young ones hatch from the egg. So I hope you understood about this topic that is the eating habits of insects. So different insects eat different type of food and we learned that all insects lay eggs. There are insects which lay eggs in water, on plants etc. Coming to page number 52 in your textbook there are two questions given. Bees feed on options nectar seeds. So where do these bees feed on? We learned that they feed on nectar and what is that nectar? The sweet liquid which is present on the flower. So the second one, insects breathe through. So two options are given, stomata, spiracles. So what is the answer? How do these insects breathe? They breathe through spiracles, the tiny holes present in the body of the insect which is called as spiracles and insects breathe through spiracles. So the answer is spiracles. So I hope you understood. So let's meet in the next class with a new topic. So till then, thank you. <music>